For today's example on transformational geometry, we'll be dealing with four topics. Reflection, a rotation, a translation, and a dilation. First, we'll start with reflection. And when dealing with reflections, we deal with an xy coordinate graph. Our first point of location is at negative 2, 2 on our graph. And if we fold our object or our, our point of location over the y-axis, we create a, mir a mirror image on the new side at a new point of positive 2, positive 2. For our second example, for rotation, we start with an object at its starting point, and an object can be re rotated from its starting point anywhere to 360 degrees until it's at, once again, its original starting point. So if we decide to rotate our object 90 degrees, it would look like that. 180, 270, and 360. Our third example is translation. And if we have our triangle, right here, and we decide to move it. A translation is a move, and if we decide to translate our triangle three spots to the right, one, two, three, four, five, we have now translated our original triangle. And fourthly is dilation, which is making an object smaller or larger in size, and if we decide to dilate this triangle by one half, we're actually reducing the size of each side by two, creating a smaller triangle. We can also do a larger one and dilate it so that the new triangle is two times the size of the original one, thus so. And those are our four examples for transformational ge geometry. Thank you.